morning. This is Shaman Oracle reading. And I haven't used the Sacred Sites Oracle for a long while. So today I thought we use it. And each zodiac sign travels to a certain sacred location. And the reading here now is for Virgo. Welcome Virgo. You travel to Italy. The location is Vatican City. And the energy focus is on secrets. Beneath the Vatican hide ancient secrets. The Phrygian was home to the Melissi, the priestesses of Rome's Magna Mater, the great mother, Sibylle. This temple was located on Vatican Hill, along with a temple of Apollo and a shrine of Dimitra's mystery cult on the site of what is now one of the holiest places of Christendom. Pagan burial crowns and the Circus of Nero, built by the Emperor Caligula, also once stood here. So much of our history has been erased. When records fail us, we must follow our intuition to learn from a sacred site. Are you drawn to any particular images on this card or to any of the names associated with this place such as Sibylle, Apollo or Mitras? Delve into books or the internet to find out more? and discover the guidance that these deities offer for your own life. Originally, the Anatolian earth goddess Sibylle was imported to Rome from abroad in the city's hour of need, when a bad harvest and famine seemed to augur defeat in war. This foreign goddess arrived in the form of a black meteorite. Have you ever considered calling on another belief system to help you out? What is the significance of the Egyptian obelisk that has stood in St. Peter's Square since 1586? When construction began in around 326 CE on the first basilica over the tomb of St. Peter, the stones of the Circus of Nero were used to build a new church. In the late 15th century, planning for a replacement basilica began and a new building's foundation stone was laid in 1506. But it was not until 1590 that the Dome of St. Peter's was completed. Are you struggling to build up a relationship or a business or do you fear that what you have achieved is about to topple to the ground? If so, consider asking for divine help perhaps from a deity, from a different culture or an ancient pantheon that you have not approached before. In the creation of Adam, the famous fresco by Michelangelo on the ceiling of the Sistine Chapel, Adam seems nonchalantly insofar as God is reaching out to him and he touches casually the finger. Beside God is the form of a woman. Could this be Eve at God's side, not made from Adam's? Ask this question. The divine spark is coming and the question is, will you rise to the occasion? Time to step out of slothfulness 
and embrace the rebirth of your soul. Know that you do not need any intermediary to connect with God. You can address the divine yourself through prayer, meditation and ritual. Put what you have been taught to one side and wake up now. Call on the Creator, proclaiming, I am here, I am ready. Make a journey into the past. Imagine standing in the vast basilica of St. Peter. Does its monumental scale and the magnificent art you see everywhere evoke awe or rather unease? To your surprise, you notice a small trapdoor beneath your feet. You can open it and climb down a wooden ladder. It is very dark in there, but as you descend, you glimpse a tiny flickering light beneath you. And when you reach the bottom, your eyes have adjusted to the darkness and you find yourself in a beautiful underground room full of statues and artifacts. A candle stands before an altar adorned with a pentagram as well as symbols of the gods and goddesses of the old ways. You see a huge Egyptian Ankh and a statue representing the mother goddess Isis. You are amazed that such dedication to ancient wisdom exists here, underneath the Vatican. You hear a soft voice saying the old ways have never been abandoned. They know the truth. You decide it is time to take your leave and return up the ladder back into the basilica, free to walk in whatever direction you decide to take. So, that was your reading, Virgo. Thank you very much for listening. I wish you a great day today. I wish you a most wonderful weekend ahead. Take care and goodbye.